piles of Legos are the actual building blocks, helping sailors get educated about the naval aviation enterprise and airspeed. Lean Six Sigma is one of the new management tools that is changing the way the Navy thinks and does business. The very first thing that we started to do was put people through a yellow belt class, and what that is is it's a, an awareness class. It basically gives a, a, a broad overview of what Lean Six Sigma is. They get a chance to experience some of the tools, how they work. You actually play with Legos, and uh, we the class takes quite a few Legos to play with. The first example is a push versus pull system. The second one is a dice game, which in, includes variability. In other words, everybody rolls a dice and you push the product through, just like any other shop um, that's in the Navy. And only a few doors down from the yellow belt training is the advanced black belt class. Here you won't find PowerPoint presentations, but rather a fresh approach to teaching, where hands-on interaction is driving home business topics like Lean, Six Sigma, and Theory of Constraints. This is really about asking why is the process run this way and how can we change that type of, uh, which most people don't think about as policy. Ask the whys. More than that, it's helping sailors become better team leaders and critical thinkers. The only thing I have to say is, if you have the chance to learn about Six Sigma and airspeed, go ahead and do it because no matter if you're in the military, it's going to Six Sigma everywhere, even on the ships and shore duty everywhere. The makeup of these classes is diverse. Training officials here say they've had everyone attend from junior enlisted to senior officers with a goal of trying to get everyone on the same page. From Fleet Public Affairs Center Pacific, I'm Petty Officer RJ Moraiva.